Hi there guys, Mad Cow Gamer. Yes, finally, bringing back Call of Duty to my channel. Um, the reason why I was gone for such a long time, I haven't uploaded anything significant, was simply because I was working on Machinima. I was in Machinima series. I finally released my episode, an entire hour and 30 minutes long. It's longer than some of the new movies coming out right now on the big screens. And you know, I'm really proud of it. Anyway, right away, jumping in back to one gun only. And, um, you know, not everything's going out really well for me right now. My grandpa's in the hospital right now. And my house is empty. So, uh, you know, even in this hard time, I just, you know, I'm like, nobody's home. Because, uh, I mean, I wasn't there. So, and the hospital is like in a completely different city than I'm in right now. And I can't get there. So, I'm like... Let's do a commentary. Anyway, guys, one gun only. Today we'll be using AUG with dual attachments as well as a camera pack as our equipment. We're using a reflex side and a grip. Now, um, once again, I believe AUG or AUG is a British-made weapon. It's also a bullpup action, which means the magazine is behind the actual firing mechanism of the weapon. I would not consider this gun to be an assault rifle. Now, the reason why I say that is that in a lot of different games, as well as military military stuff, um, AUG is usually uh, counted or looked upon as, as a support weapon, so heavy machine gun of sorts, you can say. AUGs in different games um, and in different, obviously, real life also have a larger magazine than 30. They have a uh, co completely much bigger round. They usually have a bipod, 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 uh, on its barrel and it's really good and great for uh, penetrating obviously walls it's really good for uh, covering fire for your troops to coming out as you know uh, most militaries in the world use a um, a set of squad system they have riflemen they have obviously guys with assault rifle and as well as a support gunner on their team as you can see camera spike extremely well well made web uh equipment and uh, AUG is, you know what, I had my uh, suspicions about AUG before, the reason why I shot that one uh, round is I really, really wanted to, um, <laughs> how should I tell you this, I really wanted to get that really rapid reload right there in that moment, um, as you can see I'm quote unquote camping in the spot, but since this is a domination game, I really want to defend, uh, ah, I died right there, I really want to defend the B area, and since that room gets a lot of action, the, the sure way to take your enemy's uh, edge off and make sure that they uh, pay attention to you would be to get in that room and hold it so enemies will go after you every single time. Uh, another little bit that I forgot to say about the AUG, the rate of fire on this weapon is low. That's why I, that's why I also do not consider it as a uh, assault rifle. Uh, I'm, I don't want to bring up statistics and give something wrong, but the way the weapon feels is that it feels extremely slow firing, slower firing than a K47 and other AK models. And I would definitely not use this weapon if I'm in a close quarter combat. The reason why I'm using it here is because it has great uh, penetration for the walls. It's an extremely good support weapon, as I said previously, and uh, overall, if you're playing an extremely well-made team, if you're playing with your friends and you have a uh, support of your friends, you can really use this weapon to your advantage being, as as I said before, a support rifleman. So pretty much get in that position, hold the tight spot, and rain hell on your enemies, just like I do in this game. Now, I don't remember the score, and obviously I'm going to show it in the end, but to bring a little bit more diversion in the game, I started using, after after all and the uh, weapons, all after it's after Oh, all weapons after that, I started using it the way that they're used in the militaries, especially the Russian guns. I know a lot of um, a lot of uh, different attachments that Russian military uses for their weapons, and believe me, you'll be surprised what things they don't use and what things they do. Um, the down love of camera spike for me is because I don't always pay attention to it. I always put it up, I'm like, hell yeah, I'm covered from all sides, I'm sure I'm not gonna get anything uh, get behind me, but then again, I'm paying attention to that particular guy over there, and I'm trying to get a kill on him, but then again, there's also a guy coming behind me, and I know he's there, I know he's looking at me, but oh my god. Sometimes, camera can be one of your worst enemies because you divide yourself. Once again, I should have really gotten a kill on that guy, but the last 10, I'm not bitching about it any longer, you know, I understand why it was put in the game. I uh, watched a few Brumac videos, the guys have said, watch Brumac, I know I haven't advertised anybody in a long time, and I've been heavily PC 
gaming lately, and I, you know what? I just love playing with the PC. I'm really upgrading it. I'm really hoping to bring you some nice StarCraft and stuff. In. So I'm, I'm diversifying. I don't want to stick to FPSs. As you guys know, I also also do Guild Wars. It'll be coming back as well. I'm probably going to do a commentary right after this about Guild Wars and probably render it and put it up sometime on the weekends. But overall, I would definitely say that when you're playing on Havana, you're playing Domination game, and you have this strong hold on your opponents, and you know that you can defend B, and you know that you're going to get defend A, you really want to just stay back and let them taste their own medicine. There you go. Nice grenade. Um... Uh, what's it called? Nice grenade uh, evade right there. They just, as you see, paying attention to me, pumping out those weapons, those weapons at me, trying to get a kill me. But I ain't gonna happen, people. Ain't gonna happen. When using AUG, I would definitely suggest that you burst fire just as I did right now. It's a great automatic weapon at obviously mid range, but when you really want to bring that extra edge, extra accuracy to your weapon, like with any weapon, use AUG. The difference is, is that AUG is actually extremely, extremely well made weapon for burst firing. When you know where your opponent is and you know for a fact that you're well covered and well uh, defended by your surroundings like this room, just go ahead and rain hell on them with burst fires. Small taps on the trigger is how you're gonna do it. That's how you're gonna play and win the game. As you can see, got my Blackbird. Epic Blackbird, gonna get the kills, gonna get those kills right now. Um, as always, my setup is simple. Uh, I change it sometimes to um, uh, to tailor the weapon that I'm using, not to tailor me as I use the weapon, but to tailor the weapon as I see it in real life. If it has a bigger caliber, if it has a bigger caliber, bigger rifle, better rifling inside the barrel, the the weapon's round will go through a wall, will go through a carbon, will go through a metal barrel. So putting a hardened on on that particular setup would be a logical thing to do, as opposed to putting a silencer on a heavy caliber weapon, which is would never work in the real life. But if put silencer on a, on a case on guns such as um, obviously in Modern Warfare 2 we had silencers on heavy machine guns which is outrageous stupidity of the designers of the game but nonetheless it did make it in I don't know how but anyway you will never see anybody use a silencer on a K model ever first of all the K barrels are not made for silence the round is big, it creates a loud noise, it has a huge kickback. There is no hell in the way somebody would put a silencer on an assault rifle, such as IK-47, not to mention. It was just not designed to handle a uh, not designed to handle a silencer. It was made in 47. The design is unchanging. And the silencing silencing technology during the era of World War II and after is not as clean and as chic as it is now. But you know, each to his own, I I just would never ever disgrace a K-47 again if I ever did that part of me and put a silencer on it or god forbid put something like a uh, a shotgun attachment or or a or a, oh sometimes the stupidity of people and and the inaccuracy of the game developers just drive me nuts and crazy about the weapons and how to properly use them and make them for the game I know some of these things are made to balance the game out, but don't put a weapon in the game if you know for a fact it's dominating at all ranges all the time, aka FAMAS. Now I heard that FAMAS got nerfed. I do not see any change, I still see people use FAMAS as if it was the last weapon to use ever in the game, and I'm slightly disappointed. Here I hope the FAMAS will finally become a uh, rather well-rounded weapon, something that is not overpowered. Yet I'm still getting killed by it most of the time, even though I'm the first to shoot, I'm the first to spot the enemy, I am still the one to get killed because FAMAS' firing speed is outrageous, its recoil is ridiculous, it's like ACR in Modern Warfare 2. It's something you want to use because you want to have an edge or quote-unquote stack up against your opponents, but you don't, you don't feel right when you do. As you can see right there, he's showing my camera. And I'm gonna just run out and try to kill him while he's reloading. Last chance and not stun him. That's the beauty of the camera. It can distract, it can show it an all well rounded camera spike. Something you people you should use, especially when you're a sniper and you're not using a uh, high power scope when you're using something low power is a great way to keep your back covered at the same time as keeping the power of your sniper rifle or assault rifle within your grasp this game is about to wrap up and we probably went extremely well with this uh, game i did not expect it we went 26 to 8 with one capture 
and no Where defense, even though we kind of defend it and get uh, get kills that way. But there you go, guys. Mad Cow is back. Not, not might not be the best time, but hell. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you. Please bot me on Respawn Army and vote for me. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Peace out.